All right, we're gonna waste no time here, and let's just unbox the thing. Obviously, here's the electric furnace, and let's just unwrap it. All right, here it is. And this is an 1800 watt electric furnace. If you open it, there's just silica brick, which is a uh, high temperature fire brick inside. And there's this lid here. Got the panel. And the switch. Let's plug it in and test it. We got instructions here, but we really don't use those. Alright, the display is flickering, but that's just the camera. And for P, P is start and pause. And then U, you can set the temperature. And this is the temperature that it will heat to. And right here is the temperature it's at right now. And that's because I just pressed the on button and it heated up a little bit. We're going to be melting aluminum and that melts at at least 10,000 degrees. We're going to set it to 800 Celsius because aluminum melts at around 663 Celsius. We're going to set it to 799 just to piss some of you guys off. This is the graphite crucible that goes inside and we'll just put it in with the tongs. We're going to be using some scrap aluminum to melt, and we have it heating up right here. When we take the graphite crucible out, it is red hot in there. We're at 700 degrees, and now we have our aluminum right here, and we're just going to put it in the crucible. You can see it's red hot in there. If I shut off the light, you'll be able to see it glow. All right, all aluminum is about to melt. The aluminum is sloshing around in there. Let's see if you can get the nozzle the right way. That is an aluminum ingot. Holy cow. That is crazy. It's still very hot. <laughs> oh. All right, let's pour some molten aluminum. We're gonna be pouring it into our mold again. And here's a crucible. Wow. Oh, wow. Watch this, ready? Back up, back up. More, 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 more. Back. This thing is really hot. I would not recommend using this inside because it's actually smoking. Not the molten aluminum, but the actual furnace is smoking. You can see it over here. That cannot be good. This is actually a pretty great furnace, except for the fact that on your first run, it will start smoking with the weird fumes or whatever, and the fact that it's probably gonna take like 10 hours to cool. I mean, this thing is still red hot, if you can see inside there. But other than that, it works pretty great. I hope you guys liked the video, and I'll see you next time. We'll be making more videos on this in the future.